around 7.30. I'm supposed to be at breakfast because we're leaving the boat at 8.15. Sorry I didn't end the vlog properly last night. We had dinner and then we were trying to get this GoPro time lapse to upload on Instagram stories and there was a massive kerfuffle with the music and literally nothing was working. So I ended up, up going to bed at like 1.15, which is ridiculous. Um, so I went to bed at 1.15, woke up today later than expected at 7, 7 o'clock. Now I have to go because we are going bike riding all day. Look at this view, it's insane. I'm really, really excited. All right, let's go, let's go to breakfast. All right, so I went all the way to the Windjammer, which is up to floor 15 or 16 and to the other side of the ship. And they're like, do you have your tickets? And I was like, damn, I forgot my excursion tickets. So I had to go all the way back to my room, get my tickets, and so I missed breakfast. Whoa! I'm just waiting for these guys. Well, actually, technically, I'm early because we're supposed to be meeting here at 8.15 and it's five past, or 10 past eight. Therefore, I'm not late. I'm actually on time and I'm waiting. I'm actually waiting for these guys. I can see them coming. Why are they so late? Hi guys, I've been here the whole time. Where have you been? You're getting breakfast. What do you mean? I, you I, I, I only ate breakfast. Yes. <laughs> Enjoy your breakfast. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Mallorca for a short excursion. Let's go! Hola chicas! <laughs> She's been naughty. She crossed the street on a red light. Oh, Nino! <laughs> that was bad, right? Yeah, that was very bad. Guys, so we literally just came up to this like river and he was like do you guys want to go inside this and we were like damn that looks pretty damn deep we don't we don't know if we should do that and we were all taking it off our shoes and everything and then we just saw this little puppy run through and it's like this deep so it looks like we're all going through i still want to get my shoes wet because i like these shoes all right we're going th we're going in when the lights go down i go at the Al Medina Royal Palace. This isn't the main entrance, it's just a side gate. But I'm gonna show you what's through here because there's a swan lake over there and there's actually swans inside. It's so cool, look at this. I can't believe there's actually real swans in there. <laughs> he doesn't like us. He doesn't like us anymore. He thinks you have food. When the lights go down, I go all out. I'll be standing there with you. I hear the music start to play. All I want to do is move. And I got the feeling that I'm in for a reason. It's something I've been given. So 
basically um, there's nuns that live in this convent and they bake cookies but you can't see them. The only way to order the cookies is to press the bell, speak through the little door over there and then you can order cookies that way. I'll show it to you now, it's really cool. What looks good? So they have a bunch of stuff. So Pico's and the coconut ones, those are um, our guide's favorite. And I'm gonna get some of those. Wow. And then they have almond ones too. Got a whole menu. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna get now? I'm gonna coquitos. get some, uh, what are they called? Coquitos. Coquitos. Co at the nun's drive in. What, what, what's it called? At the drive in. It's made out of coconut and They're really sugar nice. and I don't know what else. Oh, have you tried this before? I've had them before. Oh, good. No, you haven't had them? I've never had them. They, you should check, they might have chocolate cake here for you. <laughs> oh, did you see it? Did you see the show with the yeah. They only make cookies. There it isn't. It was in this page here that probably sold out today. Because you ate it all, I think, because you've been here before, no, right? I just got you here tried, my first you time. You tried the so you must have finished chocolate cake. No. Which way did it have any left? Yeah. yeah. So the bell is here. Genius. So Dan's going to order some cookies. In Spanish. In Spanish. What are you saying? Hola, cookies, por favor. Coquitos. Oh, hola, coquitos. Better not mess it up. Good morning. Ah, buenos dias. Ah, uh, hola, um, uh, coquitos, por favor. <laughs> I forgot it. <laughs> um, cookies. Ah, uh, cookies, uh, co coquitos, por favor. Una, una caja. Una caja de coquitos. Gracias. No, no, no. Yeah. Yeah, with the coconut in the middle. So good. Hey, this is the best coquito that a nun has ever made for me in my entire existence. Really? I and mean, I've had a lot of nuns from. <laughs> Where are nuns from? A lot of coquitos from nuns. <laughs> This olive tree right behind me is 600 years old. How crazy is that? Ooh, can you just imagine what this tree's been through? All the seasons, all the wars, all the changes in the environment, literally everything, it's been here. I don't know if you guys find it amazing, but I find it pretty amazing. I think it's absolutely amazing. I think it's incredible. It absolutely blows my mind. Seriously, 600 years old. That is pretty crazy. How many generations of your family go back to actually get to when this was a seedling? None. Do you know? Fun fact. No, it's not. I was going to say, a mustard seed is the smallest seed that you plant and turns into the biggest tree from the seedling that it comes from. Really? What's True. this? This is an olive tree, so it's a very different kind of plant. It's so lunch time, my favorite time of the day. Actually, it's all three meal times, but this is my second favorite. They have so many different types of salt. <laughs> Your lips are. This is very olive salt. Petals, I've never seen olive salt before. That's really cool. Salt. Mm. Yeah. Chicken's really good. How's the uh, beef? Amazing. It's actually really good. Very isn't tasty. It? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we, we just finished lunch, and now we are heading back to the ship. Really cute little town. I kind of wish we had a, a little bit more time here so we could go through the streets. But when we were riding through on our bikes, we got a really good little tour of the area, sort of the castle. It's nice. Palma de Mallorca is nice. Alright, we are back home, back for the bike tour, time to get on the ship. Yay, can't wait to rest my eyes. Hey, how many? What is the verdict? That's my home. What's the verdict? Yeah, what do you mean? pretty tired. Oh, I'm just We all went, went to bed super late last night. I'm smashed. I'm smashed. 
Shut it. Um, Thank you. Bye -bye. I was going to give you a high five. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Thank you. All right, so we just got back on the ship. What a great day in Mallorca. Saying goodbye now. Bye. Bye, Mallorca. See you next time. Hola. 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 So we went to the supermarket today and I was like, oh, all day I was like, we need to get some hand wash so we can like, you know, wash underwears and socks and stuff really, really quick and hang them up. And I saw Dan come out of the supermarket. I saw him put this in, in the thing, in his like tray, in his basket, and it's like kids hand wash. It's hand wash. It's hand wash, but That's I meant right. like, I meant like hand what wash. What were we shopping for? Hand wash. No, wash the clothes, wash, <laughs> wash that you clothes. can wash your clothes with your hands. So like. I mean, I bought these that I could just put in my sink and wash my clothes in. Wouldn't we call it laundry soap? Or hand wash. Huh? Laundry soap. Yeah, whatever, but laundry it still it still doesn't deter from the fact that you bought soap for your hands. Yeah, I like to have smelly hands that are really look, nice. Like kids. Look, a little kid's one. <laughs> Thought I'd share you, that with you. You can use it. Huh? You can use it if you want to. You can, yeah, I thanks. I have the, the smelliest, nicest hands on the ship. Oh, really? Yeah. What's the song? Uh... Wash your hands. So, for those of you that have been cruised before, all the room attendants leave really cute little towel creations on your bed every night. Tonight, I've got this little guy. Hey, buddy. How are you? So cute.